Well, as we reported earlier this week, there's been widespread sightings of the coconut rhinoceros beetle through many parts of the state. KINTV 4's Eric Nackton has more on recent reports in Wahiwa. The coconut rhinoceros beetle knows few limits in Hawaii, including potentially beloved landmarks. Micah Benevitz, president of the Wahiwa Community Business Association, lives right near historic Royal Palm Drive. He says his neighborhood is feeling the effects of a growing issue within the islands. Micah's next door neighbor found a coconut rhinoceros beetle on his property, which he put into a jar and froze, which is highly recommended. He then took a picture of it and sent it to the Department of Ag, but now it's a waiting game. What happens next? I talked to the a bunch of the other neighbors in the community on Royal Palm Drive and they've also uh, told me that they've also found coconut rhinoceros beetles in, in their yard as well and uh, one of the biggest concerns that we have is this destruction of our beautiful historical landmark of Wahiwa of Royal Palm Drive that's been around for over almost 120 years. This one in particular you notice that it, it doesn't look natural uh, you know clearly there's probably a coconut rhinoceros beetle uh, attacking the the sap which is the heart of, of the palm the larva can potentially spread through mulch and compost, and currently, CRBs are widely considered an infestation. Uh, one of the things that I'm really concerned about, even some of the others in the community, is that there's only, from what I heard, is there's only two arborists on Oahu to combat this coconut rhinoceros beetle. It's it's concerning in, in the sense that I know that time isn't on our side when it comes to this large infestation that we have on, on Oahu, and it is spreading to outer islands such as Maui. Funds have been appropriated to combat the problem, but many areas, including Wahewa, could have a lengthy wait before it's treated. Eric Nackton, KITV4, Island News. The Hawaii Department of Agriculture says the coconut rhinoceros beetle was first detected in the islands in 2013 on coconut trees at Joint Base Pearl Harbor Hickam on Oahu. They've gradually spread to other areas of the island, though. This past May, the invasive species was found on Kauai, where eradication efforts are ongoing. To this day, the state says it does not know exactly how the beetles arrived here in Hawaii. And take a look at this photo of two other beetles that may look like the coconut rhinoceros beetle. DLNR says the one at the top is a dung beetle. You can see how much smaller it is compared to the coconut rhinoceros beetle. In the middle is the oriental flower beetle, which is a non-invasive pest that has been on Oahu since 2002. This beetle is about an inch smaller than the CRB and does not have a horn, but does have white spots on its back. The CRB can range from just over an inch to about two and a half inches. Its main characteristic is a horn projecting from its head. 